Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel and in this video we will analyze our next blue chip stock from our stock analysis uh, series. So we analyzing stock by their market cap. We already analyzed Reliance, TCS, SDFC Bank, Infosys, ISSA Bank, then Hindustan Unilever, SBI, SDFC, Bajaj Finance, Bharti Redan and last was one, last one was Kotak Mahindra Bank. So today we will analyze Vipro. Its market cap stands around 3 lakh 10,000 crore rupees, and it is almost 12. It, the stock is in at the 12th position as per market cap. Last trading uh, uh, when I uh, downloaded this CSV, that time Vipro was trading around 562 on that price uh, uh, its market cap was around 3 lakh 8000 crore rupees so now let us see what uh, what was the price patterns and what is the trend on charts so let us see charts so on monthly chart we can see on last trading session we pro closed at 555 5555 uh, flat positive on monthly chart the uh, price pattern and the signals are not looking good here is the exit signal for the investor we saw buy signal around almost 200 rupees we saw high around 700 rupees now around triple five uh, Vipro already given sell signal and um, if you are investor that is exit call for you if you have uh, position in Vipro on lower side then you might keep a stop loss or try to exit from the Vipro as per monthly chart. We saw a breakdown below super trend which was uh, given by signal around 218 to 20 rupees. We saw a high around 700 and now from higher level we saw a sharp profit booking. In the uh, month of Jan we saw almost 20% drop in stock price almost 143 rupees loss and for this month we already trading 3% down almost 17 rupees down so there is a high possibility of downside move this signal might be get rejected also but if you have position uh, in Vipro which you are bought on lower level so please keep a strict stop loss or try to book some profit and you can keep other uh, share for a long term or for a bounce back more on monthly chart we are trading uh, free, uh, below pure, pure point with a sell signal on super trend on downside 507 is a 20 weeks average uh, 20 months average below that 385 is a 50 months average and last uh, support will be around 222 which is 200 months average for Vipro. Last time we taken a support around 200 months average. It was around 196, and that was uh, in Corona uh, Corona time crash. It taken support around 196. From that level, we moved to high of 700 rupees. Currently, it is showing uh, it is showing bearish sign on monthly chart and suggesting. Uh, for investor to get out of the stock or book the profit or book a partial profit or keep a, a straying stop a, a certain stop loss to your investment if you want to keep a stop loss keep stop loss below 500 rupees if you want to if that stop loss hit you should exit from this stock as as a, your investment there might be a lower level coming and you might you might get a uh, chances to enter on lower levels now let us see weekly chart so on weekly chart stock already gives us uh, exit signal around 710 from that point it given two multiple ch chances to get out and from that level we saw a slump in stock sharp profit booking from investor and now we are in a long term correction phase trading below pure points with a sell signal on super trend and now we are uh, trading below 
20 and 50 weeks averages which is also a bearish sign or a let us say it is a correction a corrective signal for the stock on downside 491 and after that 395 are the major support zone as per weekly chart those are 100 and 200 weeks averages and also they are uh, coincides with our pure points last support will be around 250 or 260 rupees if stock comes around this level by any means due to global crisis or any means then 260 rupees is a value investing opportunity for the long term investor if you find wipro around 260 start accumulating in a large quantity with a long term view Long term view means minimum 3 to 5 years view. Around 395, 396 stock will be the fair value. And around those level, if comes around those level, you can start accumulating in this stock. But uh, if you want a value by level, it will be the 260. 395 is the fair value level. From that level, there is most uh, probable chance of strong uh, long term reversal and we might see a new higher uh, in Wipro in upcoming years so currently below 575 Wipro will remain weak there might be a chance of a strong bounce back toward a super trend so if bounce back come we might see a levels up to 610 but if you have position on lower side and if you are in profit I will suggest you to exit around 610 rupees from that level we might see another reversal and we might continue our drifting down trend so keep watch on levels 396 that will the fair value buy level if comes around 260 buy in larger quantity with a longer term view and your target will be around almost 2x to 3x from that level we already saw 196 to 700 rupees so we already got almost 2.5x return from Corona's lows and that's that's the uh, bull market for you in bull market blue chip stock uh, gives uh, amazing returns and same can happen in upcoming years also if any means stock comes around 395 or a deeper correction up to 260 rupees that will be the best buying opportunity who missed uh, Wipro and uh, Wipro is my favorite stock it has a very uh, it is a, a defensive stock in IT sector when it gets in momentum the momentum lasts for days to weeks that's the uh, power of this stock and uh, you will get you can make a fortune if you uh, get right level you invest at right level and hold it for minimum one to two year you will get amazing return in this stock the, I think uh, Wipro will be the next in fee or say TCS after SL Tech the next stock uh, I like is Wipro and I ha I, uh, I have my bets on it. it it has a very very high potential to give higher return in upcoming years so that's a uh, that's the Wipro for you on weekly chart. Now let us say uh, daily chart for short term trading. So on daily chart we can see we are uh, trading below 200 days average. We saw breakdown then a stock tried to retest 200 days average rejected again gone below taken support around previous lows again bounce back. So it is taking support around previous lows of 535 530. So expect a big move on downside below 530 only. On upside we can see we might test once again 590 or 600 levels in upcoming days and our stock is showing early signs of that. If stock goes above 5, uh, 590 there might be chances of reversal also. So let us see and wait and watch. But above 590, I will not suggest you to short a stock for swing trading. In that scenario, only find long opportunity. Currently, it is showing uh, early signs of recovery, recovery towards 590, 600 rupees levels. So from current level, there might be 
rally of almost 45 to 50 rupees in upcoming days on downside 535 is a major support zone 530 to 535 if it breaks below that then we might see a slump toward 400 rupees and there be, there might be a sharp sell off in this stock below 530 rupees only so above 530 rupees there is more possibility of recovery toward 600 rupees 590 to 600 rupees as last two candles I uh, I have bet on long side I think this stock will recover to 600 rupees so if you want to take a risk you can go long uh, let us see hourly chart for a, a short term trade in Vipro so on hourly chart you can see here 537, uh, 537 was the last month low and stock continuously taking support around those level rejecting that level sellers are got rejected around those level and now on hourly chart Vipro is in buy signal with bullish uh, bullish price pattern and bullish signal on indicator and it might show a sharp recovery to our 580 590 rupees levels yeah so uh, my strategy here will be buy around 545 550 uh, levels your stop loss will be below 530 your target will be 590 600 rupees for one to two weeks that is short term trade for you if you, you can trade it in cash also if you have a larger account higher risk potential then you can trade also in futures or if you are option trader focus on uh, call option of 560 rupees try to accumulate that option on lower levels on decline and uh, your stop loss will be same if uh, stock goes below 530 you have to take loss from that option exit with the loss and your target will be 590 so you might get a 2x to 3x return in that option because it become in the money option above uh, around 590 you will get a 30 point premium and plus a time value premium so will you will get a, a a good return if stock hits 590 600 rupees so focus on 560 call option of Vipro March series and that will be the my bet buy on this strategy on that option but you have to enter around 545 550 rupees, 550 rupees mark your stop loss will be below 530 the risk will be around 2 almost 15 rupees to 20 rupees your reward will be around 50 rupees so uh, uh, best risk reward uh, risk reward ratio comes around 1 is to almost 3 so that's the Vipro for you we saw a short term trade long side weekly chart there also there are also early recovery sign towards 600 rupees on monthly chart there is exit signal it might get rejected but clearly stock given exit signal for the investor we might see a bounce back towards 600 rupees 610 but that will be the exit opportunity for the investor we might see a deeper correction coming in upcoming days so that's the Vipro for you we already uh, uh, covered all daily hourly weekly and also monthly charts so I hope so this video will help you for your investment in Vipro also for your trading Vipro so friends please like the video share the video with your family and friend if you like my videos please uh, uh, subscribe to my channel and also you can find all the information regarding me in the description and thank you for watching this video subscribe now and press the bell icon never miss an update